Hey, this is Tony Kegger. I'm going to do a quick uh, Road to SummerSlam video. To make this easy, I'm just going to show you um, the current match card for SummerSlam. This is, this is um, Lords of Pain's website. They just posted this like, um, I don't know, 30 minutes ago. Raw just ended like um, 10 minutes ago. So here we go. Here's the updated card for SummerSlam. Lesnar vs. Cena. Page vs. AJ, Ziggler vs. The Miz, Rusev vs. Swagger, Jericho vs. Bray Wyatt, Stephanie McMahon vs. Brie Bella, and uh, let's see what else we got here. Randy Orton vs. Roman Reigns, and Steph Rollins vs. Dean Ambrose, with a stipulation to be announced on SmackDown by Ambrose. So you see that right there, we have eight matches, right? Yeah, eight matches. So I don't think we're going to see any more match after the card. And those are the foul eight. Um, could could one of these matches be on the pre-show? Like, absolutely. I think if there's any match going to be on the pre-show, it's going to be Ziggler and The Miz. Like, none of these matches, none of these other matches can be in the pre-show. There's no way. Um, yeah, so there's the matches. I'll be right back. Okay, so... Okay, so we have our um, eight match from SummerSlam now. I do not expect any more matches to be set. Um, so we're not going to see goals for the Cody Rhodes. We may not even get goals in Cody Rhodes' take team match. Sorry, Cody Rhodes now is Stardust. Maybe maybe it'll be that the pre show. I don't know. I just don't, I'm not sure they can do eight matches in the main card. Unless one of those matches get really short. Like maybe Ziggler and The Miz gets only like, I don't know, like seven minutes. But I like this card. Really good. You look at the card. All, like, there's not that many, like, matches that are going to be great. There's, like, um, you know, Lesnar, maybe a couple of them could be a match of the year contenders. Lesnar versus Cena and Ambrose versus Rollins. Those are legit, like, match of the year contenders. I'm not sure if any of the other matches have that potential of being match of the year contenders. But a lot of these matches are going to be, like, you know, really good. Like, enjoyable like I don't like it's possible there could be no bad matches it's you know it's, no guarantee it's gonna happen but it's possible and that'd be awesome that's those shows are the best when you know if every match is at least good it's fun there's lightning out here um so yeah if every match is at least like watchable and enjoyable that's someone said it's gonna be awesome but again my full summer slam preview coming up soon you know once once uh, next week's Raw is the Smackdown is over then I'll have the full preview go over every match but right now I like these matches really good even um, Ziggler versus The Miz is like the only weak match in the card only because that, not that it can't be a great match it could be it's like that's the only match that like doesn't have a long storyline or, or nice like build up I, like I know like Cena and Lesnar just got made like couple weeks ago but that goes back to 2002 that whole feud in Riley so all these all these matches like they've been building these stories up for like over a month now except for the Miz and the Ziggler that's kind of a new feud and it feels like just a I don't know it doesn't feel like a SummerSlam match you know and I'm just afraid it's like they got this, this card does not need eight matches seven matches would be perfect so I'm a little worried about Ziggler and Miz just taking away time from other matches that need it. But we'll see what happens. Ziggler and Miz, it should, that, should, that could be a good match. But I'll go over every match for my preview. Thanks for watching. See you later.